Yo, what is going on, guys, and welcome back to the channel. We got some crazy, exciting, and drama-filled news, such as, such as some clutches um, that happened to me on an East, but we are not going to be covering that, because that's going to be part of the shout-out I'm going to give to a certain company but we're going to focus mainly on the drama filled topics after that such as Ram Ranch back at it with another another fake video yes Ram Ranch he makes fake videos and lies about me he post he posted some voice he posted a TikTok with some voice recording titled Nick caught saying the N word on stream it's a huge lie and the Hi, and the voice is completely fake, but that's not all we're going to be covering, guys. We are also going to be covering Mangoes. Yes, one of my previous duos. A few days ago, he made the switch back to Fortnite and even played in a few games with me. It looks like he might be making his return. Congratulations, Hearn. Now, before we get into the video, I'd want to quickly shout out pro guides if you don't know what pro guides is basically what they'll do is they'll, is they'll teach people how to go pro in video games such as league of legends csgo valorant fortnite smash bros all that so if you're trying to go pro in fortnite this is definitely the website for you their pro memberships will give you unlimited access to courses and all that you can even play in one-on-one -on -one sessions with coaches. I'm going to give you guys a little bit of footage of me playing with my coach, DW, just so you guys can understand how and how Pro Guides works and why I'd highly recommend it if you're trying to go pro. Let's go in, roll the clips. Hey, Dion. I got him. Oh my got God. him, let's go. Uh oh. Yo, he's cracked. Yeah, let's go. I got cracked as well. Yeah, that looked kind of insane, right? I mean, sh I mean, sure, there were some flaws, but they will help you out if you are trying to go pro. Oh, so go check out Pro Guides. I'll check it. I'll leave. I'll leave a link in the description. But anyways, now we are going to be exposing Ram Ranch because he posted another fake TikTok once again titled Nick caught saying the n-word on stream it's a huge lie and the eh, and the voice is completely fake I'm going to roll the voice recording but we'll bleep out the cuss words just so you guys can understand how bad this guy is and how he's lying about me and literally he sounds nothing like me I'm going to roll the clip Hey, what's up, guys? It's your friendly YouTuber Nick here, and I just want to explain that Ram Ranch is a dumb nigger. Yeah, okay, yeah, okay. Ram Ranch, clearly, I mean, night and day, you sound nothing like me, so if you're trying to lie about me, no one's gonna fall for it because you are gonna be exposed in this because. I don't think, yeah, you might be thinking, yeah, you're not, I'm not gonna expose you. Dude, I'm obviously gonna expose you because you, I just played the voice recording and compare this to my voice right now. So, how? Do you, I honestly think Ram Ranch, like, he needs to be punished. He should not be allowed to do this and he should not be allowed to do this and get away with it. It is driving people, it is driving me crazy. Hey, even my fans tell Ram knew that Ramran sounds nothing like me and even tell him to stop lying. It's a terrible thing to do. And he responded to all of them by flaming and yelling at them, saying that it's for fun and it's for content. It's like, dude, you can 
Dude, like, honestly, it doesn't, it seems Ram Ranch does not even realize that he's actually lying. Like, straight up ruining pro gamers' careers by lying to people. How much worse can it get? Dude, you need a reality check? And honestly, if you get banned on social media permanently for lying again, guess what? I don't think anyone's gonna feel bad. You knew it would possibly come, and you continue to lie and laugh about it. Now... Do not go out and lie about others, guys. Lying is bad. You will get in trouble. And dude, Ram Ranch, if you do get in trouble for lying, guess what? I don't think anyone's going to feel bad for you because you knew it would possibly come and you continue to do this and laugh about it. Moving on to the last subject of today is Mangos possibly making his return to Fortnite. So, a few days ago, oh, on Friday... So on a Friday, or actually a Saturday morning before I heard that my uncle died, I will leave that video in the description. Technically, M Mangos wants to come back to Fortnite. He and I did play some trios with my duo Artos, and he did super well. I can't believe it, man. I'm going to roll a clip of a clutch that he actually helped us in in a endgame. Let's go ahead and roll that. Yeah, we're pretty great on We're going to party. Show up, me, guys. Got nice, Yeah, so there you go. Mangoes is legit wanting to come back to Fortnite. He is not sure yet. I'm going to let all of you know that soon, but I will be talking with Mangoes in a future video, asking, asking if he will come back to Fortnite, just so I can confirm without him yelling at me saying he's not coming back and all that. Like, I will have a chat with him on a future video, but for now, that's going to be it for me. I don't want this make this video too long. I am out of here, guys. Guys, again, check out Pro Guides. They have very good uh, coaches and all that. I'm out of here. Peace. Okay, so this part will have my face. Uh, I want to make this quick. Uh, before I end the video, actually, I want to say we have recruited a new Fortnite player. His name is Chris Ellsworth. He is in my class, and he is a real, and he is a controller player. He's mostly into making content. He will also be a part of a content creation squad, but will still be on the main Fortnite roster. Okay, bye.